Good news for your wallet. Good news for your wallet. Starting tomorrow, you could face an additional fee each time you swipe your credit card. And that's because businesses will be able to start adding a surcharge to offset the processing fees they pay to accept credit cards. This comes after a recent class action settlement resulted in Visa and MasterCard giving small businesses the power to add their own fee to cover the costs. The Canadian Federation of Independent Business says nearly 20% of merchants are considering implementing the surcharge. It's capped at 2.4% or the actual cost of accepting a card, whichever is lower. We've got more on this story online, what the changes to the credit card fees could mean to you. Find it on our website, ctvnewstoronto.ca. More bad news. Shalom. I'd like to say all praises due to Yahweh, Bashem El Shai. Let's say double honor to the apostles of Great Millstone, of whom I learned this truth, peace and blessings to the hopeful members of the elect, of whom I hope to be. My name is Connor Walk from GMS Toronto. A quick uh, impromptu, quick lesson. Um, in regards to the climate, you know, we know that this place is um, going to be totally cashless. And uh, yeah, that's what's pretty much in, in the motion. And uh, this is already going on right now with uh, the damn, uh, the, COV the COVID or the Corona thing, you know, and... Um, with that whole thing what they're pushing right now on the people to go uh to go get in their flesh whatever whatever it's linked up with the um with the l l pro protein all right um basically it's linked up with that and uh other people who got juiced up uh who got the uh who got the shot you know they're pretty much uh they're pretty much patent now all right by the l the l patent or the l protein right. so um i can't really say the word oh uh, because they might uh strike my my channel so i'm not gonna really uh say it but uh yeah it's getting real and uh there's gonna be no cash so uh your credit card yeah like your credit card your mastercard all these damn cards you know that we have in our damn wallet this is gonna be obsolete all right and it did and they're they're rolling out this new system we're just gonna there's gonna be a social credit score system you know that's gonna be uh implemented on the sheeple and uh, that, that's why this place is going right down we see uh the wars that's the, the the you know wars in the air you know uh we see the russians and chinese they're right by the coast of alaska like russia and alaska is right there you know they have a submarine and all that man so uh it is getting hot in the kitchen and it's about to go uh real man you know you could go if you uh do some research you could do uh, a little research on the social credit score system and uh motb the mark you know and uh, do your research all right because uh this is we're heading to that this system and we're already in it we are already in it all right and uh all the people who uh for the past two years who who lined up to go get the the thing you know um they're all uh, they're all already bought and paid for basically you know by the elite the sheeple you're gonna have no freedom no liberty and um uh, that that's why the Lord's gonna come and he's gonna deliver his elect in the one third. No Revelation thirteen and sixteen, he had power to give life to the image of the beast, that the image of the beast should both speak and cause that many who not worship the image of the beast should be killed, right? So this is we're living in the image, right, of uh, you know, the Roman Empire. 
the pagan Roman Empire that's that's coming back to life, right? With uh, NATO, the EU, all right, and um, yeah, and, and it's the system back it back back to life. You know, we're already under their. Uh, you know, our, everything that we've been buying and selling and whatever with the everything is, is linked up with the them um like the universal barcode all right and um you know everything that you buy in the store is linked up with the universal you know barcode you know and um you know they want to track everything you know and track even and track yourself right because we're already under the system with a um, SIM card, you know, birth certificate, and all that stuff. So you're, you're under the, you are prop. We are property of the of the uh, international banking families, right? Right. The um, the international monetary, um, or the international banking families who run the world. All right, and um, they're. Uh, Small, small, you know, they're the one percent who run the world, right? And, um, yeah, and they wanna, um, you know, they're gonna take away your liberty, your freedom, and you will be a slave, right? And, um, you know, we're not, you know, like, we're, you know, we're just, uh, in this system, we're just in this world, but we're not of this world, so we're gonna rely on faith. You know to deliver us out of these things and cause all both small and great rich and poor free and bond to receive a mark in their right hand or in their forehead right so if you if you are if you're not if you if you don't understand what this is or whatever like you're dumb you're you're blinded all right you know um you um you different camps right you you uh iuic uh certain 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 camps who's not who's not preaching or warning the sheep or or like it, warning the sheep of um you know of this prophecy you know like you know that means that you're not of the elect right and and you're gonna be destroyed and that no man might buy or sell save he that had the mark the name of the beast or the number of his name here the patience let all the all him that have understanding and count the number of the beasts for the number of a man and his hundreds is six hundred three score and six all right and then you go into the the greek alphabet you know with the six you know they're basically roman or greek like characters all right and um it would be Kai Sai Stigma. Alright, so we're under this. We're already living in it, in this system. That's why we have the universal barcode. A barcode the 666 six, six. all right this 666 six, six. right right here right here there right there, you know this is uh this is the thing right this is what's uh what's being been using what's been uh running this world you know for a, a long time you know from grade from world war one world war two you know what was i looking for i was looking for yeah kai shy stig
you know, the Kaisai stigma, right? And this is gonna be uh, the mark, right? This is gonna be the mark, right? That's gonna brand these people, all right? All right. Revelation 14 um, and the third, I mean, let me, let me um, I'm gonna show you another video and then uh, I'm gonna close out and then go back to the scriptures. Okay. Yeah. You know, I'd like to say that this video really touches my heart because I really think the Ukrainians are lucky that Americans have sent them billions of dollars so they don't have to live in the aftermath of what happens when a tyrannical government takes control of your way of life. Because that's essentially what we're looking at right here. The only difference is this is not Ukraine. As you're going to see here in a minute, English writing right there, which is not their native language, this is California. These are Californians. These are American citizens. This is America that lives like this. Yet the leaders of America are sending billions of dollars to Ukraine to help them out with their problems, not to mention arming them with weapons that our own government is telling us we couldn't use to fight off a government anyway, as if that makes sense. But here we have Americans living like this, right here, while our leaders are taking billions of American dollars and sending them to Ukraine. Kind of makes you wonder, what's their priorities actually set to? Yep, so it's going to get real. I was just as, wa I was just as watching a brother in uh, South Carolina. You know, uh, he was, uh, you know, like they're out there, the two brothers, and they were going... Uh, Oh, like the elder, he was going into. Um, he was pro he's prophesying, and then there was a guy wearing a Halloween costume with uh, uh, either my another white girl and whatever, and uh, and they're basically dressed up like the Walking Dead, right? And it's not even is is it's the time of so-called Halloween, but come on, man, like. You know, it just shows you, man, that these people are bogged out and they are the real walking dead, man. And uh, it's going to get real. It's going to be a third world country. You know, America, Canada, it's going to be a third world country. You know, because all hell is going to break loose. We see what's happening in Florida, in uh, Nova Scotia, Newfoundland, PEI, you know, uh, with, the, with the hurricanes. And there's been a lot of death here man in uh, North America man and um, and this is just beginning of hurricane season uh, there's a lot of judgment man the most is dishing up and the most I is is bringing this judgment swiftly the third angel followed them saying with a loud voice if any man worship the beast and his image and receive them his mark in his forehead or in his hand the same shall drink the wine and the wrath of Yahweh which is poured out without mixture in the cup of his indignation and he shall be tormented with fire and brimstone in the presence of the holy angels and the presence of the lamb so we're approaching uh, the ultimate ultimate war the la the war of all wars to end all war man and um this you know you you see what's going on with north korea and japan you know like you know like north korea basically for the 14 for basically uh for a couple of days they did uh 14 different tests over there in japan so and japan like they have their weapons you know their missiles and stuff china's right there taiwan you know then you have arabia you know egypt is back and, and like saudi arabia they you know they're backed by the americans you know see uh you know you have um the amalekites you know over there in the land of israel and stuff you know and then you have russia it's gonna be a, it's gonna be a all-out bloodbath man and that's what is all gonna happen, man. Right? Everything is gonna. When the Lord comes, 
you know, um, Second Ezra's thirteen, you know, goes into that. You know the you know that when the Lord comes with the ship, you know, just like that movie with Independence Day with Will Smith, when uh, it was uh, the Lord he came, or basically it's like a mountain, right? And um, the sky the sky was bright, and then the cl the sky and then the sky like the the, the sun became dark, you know. And uh, yeah, and it's gonna get real, and we're gonna see this thing in this in our lifetime, and this thing could kick off at any time, man. Because uh, once this the stock market crash, man, that's it. The same shall drink the wine and the wrath of Yahweh, which is poured out without mixture, into the cup of his indignation, man. So it's gonna be a hundred proof. Right, righteous indignation, man. Cause the Lord's gonna be angry. The angels, Yahweh, Yahweh Shai, man, and he shall be tormented with fire and brimstone in the presence of the holy angels, and in the presence of the Lamb, and the smoke of their torment ascending up for ever and ever, and they shall not rest day nor night who worship the beast and his image and whoso receiveth his mark in his name mark of his name all right so you people who's gonna who like who who's already has the mark or whatever you you people are gonna be dropping dead man you know so we wanna um stay in the faith you know and uh like we don't want you know uh like we want to have the thawa the and you know being exempt from judgment all right when you go in ezekiel 9 like we want to have the thawa the exempt from judgment right because you, like look at this i seen this on instagram of a brother um and basically this is uh new new york post ukraine plans uh up like up like it said ukraine plans uh apocalyptic orgy in the event of putin launch nukes you know so it just shows you man that these people are wicked and that's why the lord's basically he's gonna esau's gonna everything that we went through all right with slavery you know we were basically we're basically for like over almost 600 years all right you know from 14 you know from basically every our, our our empires fell to shit all right and basically uh, 453 you know um you know with constantinople or the byzantine empire and then the ottoman turks came and took over and then spain the spanish inquisition and whatever we were driven out you know from those land we were persecuted and uh that's why the lord man you know he's gonna he's gonna judge you either might or like he's gonna judge you whole like righteous man because these people after the hundred years man you know th this is gonna be a long hundred years this is not gonna be a normal hundred this is gonna be a long hundred years and after you know like we're not gonna have no need of you damn either mites man so with that let the say all praise due to you how about you now Double honor to the apostle of Great Millstone. Peace and blessings to the hope of members of the elect. We gotta uh, stay on fire as much as we can. You know, trim our lamps. You know, because uh, you know our the stocks is going. No, you know, because our because our, because right now our stocks is is rising, man, going up. So you know, we gotta keep pushing this truth and uh, edify. You know, one another. Uh, and and just edify the sheep all right hopefully this video was edifying uh so with that let us see our praise due to how about shame our share the ones to the apostle of great millstone peace and blessings to the hopeful members of the elect of whom i hope to be shalom